the declamation piece for English Week, taken for granted. Christians, Christians, have you heard that call? They're looking for me. That's definitely me. You're in doubt. And why? You want me to show you proof? Oh, that's very easy. Who told you to doubt that I am Christian? I am Christian how? I go to church. I pray. I read the Bible. I have a religion. I love kids and I'm giving them what they want. And I sing gospel songs. Now you're telling me that you're in doubt? How dare you question me? Can't you see? Or are you blind? I'm the true definition of a Christian. You're so pathetic. You don't even have the right to question me that way. What? You want to ask me more? I'll think about it for a second. Hmm. All right. I think I can answer all your questions fluently. Go. Ask me. You're asking me if I go to church every Sunday? <laughs> I told you. I go to church. But, but not every Sunday. Every other Sunday, I guess that's fine with the Lord. Why? I have a project. A, a, a project, yes. The, the Lord understands that. Liar? <laughs> I'm not a liar. I'm telling you the truth. In fact, I went to church the last three Sundays straight. And oh my gosh, Chris is on stage. He's playing the guitar. Oops, I slip. Okay, fine. I went to church the last three Sundays straight without absent, not because of Christ, but because of Chris. He's cute. He's talented. But I'm still there for the Lord. Liar? I'm not a liar. I'm still a Christian. It just so happens that I didn't have any project those last Sundays. Ugh, fake? I'm not a fake Christian. At least I go to church. Don't shout. Ugh, I'm not a fake Christian. I, I pray every other day. A at least I pray. No, stop. I'm a true Christian. I read the Bible. I open it every time the pastor is telling me to do so. Okay, stop. Why do we have to argue? I guess I really don't know what Christianity is. Okay. I don't go to church not because of Christ, but because of Chris. I sleep there every time as a sermon because I only love the music. I don't read my Bible because I guess that's boring. I sing Jesus, I surrender, I draw near, I fall down. But to be honest, I'm not sincere with that. But I guess my works will be credited in his name. I share my blessings to the poor. I give gifts every Sunday. And I have a religion, I guess that works. I don't know. Right. Ephesians chapter 2, verse 8 to 9 was right. It is not by works that I'll be saved because Jesus is the only way. I'm so wrong, I don't need to remind his sacrifices on the cross. I'm supposed to be there because those are my sins. I forgot my purpose here on earth. You know what? He's been good to me. But I always take him for granted. I'm doing things not for his glory, but for my own. I should live for him because he died for me. I'm so ashamed now. But Lord, you still forgave me. You're so good. And you brought me to my knees. Now I'm talking and standing in front of you. And I don't even care if you're going to laugh at me. I care to tell you things that I believe I must tell you. He won everything in me. And he's been waiting for you too. If you believe you have him, you may now shout what Carmon once wrote. Jesus is the champion. Thank you.